YouTube kick. You see him? Tie, white shirt, white mic, red thing. But I'm not going to be doing this same uh, outfit, guys. I'll try to switch it up with different shirts and stuff like that. But I told you we were going to move over to a tie eventually. It just took some time. I had to learn how to, you know, tie a tie. Thanks, Dad. Just kidding. <laughs> but nonetheless, here we are. Today we're going to be starting with uh, Bay Bay. So let's hop right on into it. Oh, man, this is a crazy story. So we got Bebe here. She said that she had broken up with her boyfriend because he said that she was getting big. And I know this is harder for you guys to see, so I'm going to read it to you. <clears throat> Let me get my voice ready. Y'all ready? Let's do it. Hey, I never said you weren't beautiful. I, and I never said I didn't love you. In fact, I said how beautiful you are and how much I loved you. But I always said I would be honest with you. And your face was changing so I told you it was. That was the conversation we were having and you asked because I care. You would rather I lie to you? You gained 35 pounds, obviously. And you gained weight and your face changes. Should I just pretend it didn't happen? And that's it? Okay. Come on. I gained three pounds and you call me chubs and fat. Doesn't mean you don't love me. If you're trying to find reasons to break up, this makes sense. But it's not the real reason. If you're unhappy with me, yourself, with the life, and don't see a future with us, then that's okay. And that's the reason. Don't use something like that to weaponize your anger, your anger or anxiety or any insecurity you may have. You know I've always found you to be beautiful and loved you no matter what. I think it's important for you to think about the things and write things down. Speak to a therapist and do this retreat thing to get the root of the problem. Let me know if you'd like to speak if you need more clarity. Love you. Put the camera back on me. DJ, listen here. Baby, if that's how you say your name, I, I don't know you as an artist, okay? But I want to say this. Listen. Listen, this, this does happen in relationships. Some people use stuff to find a way to get out of relationships. And I am so glad at the end he said go to therapy. Men, how many times have you had to say that to your woman that you broke up with or whatnot? That therapy is so important. It is expensive, but obviously Bebe has the money. Um, I think it's crazy that, you know, him saying that you should lose a little bit of weight. I don't think that's that crazy to me. You know, I gained a lot of weight in my relationship and it took a long time for me. It was not until my wife had taken a picture of me and I was like, okay, whoa, I'm out of control. I'm still losing weight today, guys. I still have to change up my diet and all that kind of stuff. I think it's important. And I, I always tell my wife to be honest with me because my health is the number one thing. I want to be around for my kids. So if I'm fooling myself at any point and thinking that I'm losing weight and I'm really not, I'm eating terrible, my wife will do it. She tries to do it more jokingly, but I, I hear it. You know, she might be like, oh, you're, 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 bang, you're eating a lot. Bang this, dang that, you know? And I'm honest. And I do the same thing with her. I'll be like, babe, I mean, you're, you're drinking a lot of soda, you know? Because this, this stuff matters, guys. Our health matters. If Because all of us get stressed out. All of us go through life. And all of us stop seeing what we need to be seeing. We start avoiding the mirror. We start avoiding the scale. And we don't see that we're gaining so much weight because we don't want to deal with it. You need somebody who's going to be truly in your life and be your friend and your love and say, hey, look, you need to start making some changes because your health is going to start depleting. And then what comes when you start gaining weight? Depression, anxiety, you start getting angry at the world. All this stuff happens when you start gaining weight. And it looks like she was already taking it out on him. So he asked her to go get therapy. So there's nothing wrong with what he said. He didn't even say it in a mean way. He said, it. see, people always talk about why do you think beauty and weight go together? He literally said she wasn't, she said she was beautiful. But she took it as, hold on, guys. She took it as him saying she wasn't beautiful just because he said that she put on weight. Okay, so that's a you problem, right? You're thinking that gang weight means no longer beautiful. That is something that you need to go work on. He even tells her to have fun at the retreat. But apparently they're all broken up. It's already over. But if she thinks that this is something. You know what's so funny about this, by the way? She released this text message. She did this, not him. She released this text message. And so she thinks that she's validated and all that stuff. Women, y'all got to stop doing this. At this some point, you've got to stop trying to validate yourself through text messages. I tell it, you know, obviously, you know, everybody does this kind of stuff. They want to put people on blast. 
baby, you just it's just it's honestly beneath you at this point to be sitting out text messages when it is clear that you've gained weight. Okay, he said 35 pounds, so clearly you've gained a lot of weight. And what normally leads to weight gain, normally, like I said, depression, anxiety, all that kind of stuff may lead to weight gain. And the bad thing about gaining weight when you're going through all that is the weight gain makes it even worse. You may be depressed, so you start gaining weight, you get more depressed because you're gaining weight. If you ever remember that old Austin Powers movie where he says, I eat because I'm sad, and then I'm sad because I eat. I'm pretty sure it was that, something like that. I don't remember verbatim, but it's like that. So it's just the same circle. It's like I'm eating because I'm sad, and I'm sad because I eat so much. It's just like, well, I'm the, you'll never get out of it. You need somebody in your life that would say this kind of stuff to you. I always, and I said this before, and I and I want to mention this again. I made a video not too long ago. If you want to go back to my YouTube channel and watch one of my shorts, I said that the people who don't tell you that you are gaining weight and they lie to your face, get rid of them. And I'm serious about that. True love is not letting somebody gain weight and fall apart right in front of you. True love and true friends will tell you the truth out of love. Do y'all think he was right? Wrong. I don't know. Goodbye.